Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alana and in today's video we are going to talk about the Viking Sky. For those who don't know, I will give a quick recap and get into our updates of the details of what has been going on with the Viking Sky over this past weekend. Now, on Saturday, the Viking Sky had sent out an SOS signal, a Mayday signal, as they had engine failure as they were one mile off of the Norway coast. They were experiencing extremely strong winds, 26 foot waves, a very scary condition for all of the passengers and crew that were on board. Considering these very rough conditions, the solution that they found was to evacuate by helicopter. They were able to release the ship's anchor to help stabilize and have helicopters evacuate passengers. Now, from the reports that I've seen, this was a very lengthy process and very scary. There was a lot of passengers that were uh, uploading photos and videos of the current situation and throughout the night as they were evacuating evacuating one and two passengers at a time. It was a very scary experience getting into the helicopter and being lifted up because of course with these high winds and rough seas the rescue boats couldn't come to them. That was their only alternative. So over 900 passengers have since been rescued and now uh, everyone has since evacuated the ship. The cruise was supposed to still go until tomorrow, but of course has ended early. Luckily, everyone is safe. Only one person is in critical condition and uh, numerous others uh, have been hurt, but um, you can expect the others that are hurt are with broken bones, cuts, bruises from being banged around uh, during the ship's really rocky turbulence uh, at sea. Now an ongoing investigation will be going on for the Viking Cruise Line as to why the Viking Sky even went out into these rough seas in the first place as uh, severe weather warnings had gone out before this cruise uh, set sail. So it has been a very scary and traumatic time for the passengers and crew on board. I can't imagine how scary this must have felt and been for them. Uh, Thank goodness so many of them are safe and have walked away with, uh, you know, no more physical harm and hopefully that the one that is in critical condition has a speedy recovery and I really do hope everyone can overcome what is just have been such a traumatic experience for them over the weekend. One passenger even mentioned that it was the most traumatic thing of their life and that they really thought this was the end and that they would not safely see off of the ship and that that would be the end of their life. So incredibly traumatic experience and very scary. We are just very thankful that everyone is uh, safe and that uh, we can move forward knowing that everyone has uh, been removed safely. Thank you so much for watching. That'll do it for the Viking Sky update. I hope you enjoyed seeing this. If you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up and subscribe for more. Let me know in the comments below if you'd like to see me do additional news updates on cruise stories just like this. Thanks so much. Ciao for now.